What's going on, everybody? Ryan Williams here of FanDuel. You can follow me on Twitter at RyanAlexander underscore W. And I'm here on another edition of the FanDuel Hurry Up. We're talking about the week two value plays when we're talking about the FanDuel main slate for DFS, baby. Week one was fun. We're here to talk about some plays from week two. Let's get into it. We'll start off at the quarterback position. Derek Carr coming in at 7,300 in probably one of the most favorable matchups on the slate. He's going to be the the late game hammer or afternoon slate hammer as we as we like to talk about. And it's just going to be a, a bonanza going against the Arizona Cardinals. We saw what Patrick Mahomes was able to do, ripping them up. And this Arizona Cardinals defense, they've had some injuries, um, but they've just been giving up big plays I mean the past eight games we're looking at them allowing multiple passing touchdowns in seven straight games we're looking at quarterbacks scoring 21 passing touchdowns to only one interception against this defense I know it makes you a little bit weary targeting a guy like Derek Carr but just how favorable I think that they're going to be in passing situations with Devontae Adams joining the team you got to target Derek Carr this week We'll move on to running back and we'll talk about Daryl Henderson. He comes in at 6,200 and when we're looking at Daryl Henderson, he checks a lot of the boxes that we like for just targeting running back. You're looking at a double digit home favorite here. He's the leading back. He saw 85% of the backfield touches in week one, uh, tied for the highest implied team total on the slate, 28 and a half points that the Rams are expected to score here and it, it's just a matchup that I, I just don't think you can pass up on with Daryl Henderson now we'll see what Cam Akers is able to do we you know the health was an issue in week one Sean McVay wants him to be a little bit more aggressive but Hendo and just the way that Sean McVay has treated lead backs and if Hendo's going to be that guy at 6200 we're really getting too cheap of a price tag on a lead back here so fire up Henderson with confidence this week Last but not least, we'll talk about a wide receiver here, rookie wide receiver, and that's Jahan Doxson, who's now a favorite to win Offensive Rookie of the Year on the FanDuel Sportsbook at 8-1. to one. And Jahan Doxson comes in at 5,500. He gets a favorable matchup here going against the Detroit Lions, who are just shredded by A.J. Brown uh, and Jalen Hurts in, in Week 1. And, and so when we're looking at that, okay, so the wide receiver 1 production, I think of Terry McLaurin, but look at what Jahan Doxson did. He ran 40 pass routes. I I think that you know Carson Wentz can look to get him a little bit more involved in this game after only seeing five targets two of those going for touchdowns but just in this favorable matchup as a price tag that with that production that he saw in week one it should be higher than this price here so I'm willing to go back to the wall on Jahan Doxson uh, with the way that Carson Wentz is, is showing us that he's gonna potentially throw the rock this season. Guys, that's going to do it for me on this edition of the FanDuel Hurry Up. From your boy, Ryan Williams, you can follow me on Twitter at RyanAlexander underscore W. I'll catch you guys in week three. Until then, get that money. Peace.